Hi folks, Swiss Bohemian here. As I promised you in my last manga update video, I said that I would do an unbox video of my latest manga haul from Japan and voila, here is the parcel. So let's open it. Yeah, so first volume 4 of Kunoichi Tsubaki no Mune no Uchi. You probably realized in the last video that I got only volumes 2, 3, 5 and 6. That's because Baiyi does problems. I have to use a proxy server Baiyi. Honto does not ship outside of Japan anymore. And the basket in Honto, like the, the switch from Honto to uh, Baiyi makes really a lot of problems. And I have to always double check if everything is in the basket. So I'm glad I got now volume 4 as well. Then I got Cannibal Family Hitokui Kazaku by Fukumitsu Shigeyuki. Let's say his art style is not really mainstream, but I like it quite a lot. And I think I'll do a video one day about the manga I got from him in my collection. So this looks like it's a peculiar gag manga for peculiar tastes, quite quirky. Is there anything beneath? Okay, this looks good. I like that a lot. The drawings, like I said, I like them. So this seems to be like his latest manga. And it is published by Futabasha Action Comics. Then I got eight volumes of Akebi-chan no Sera Fuku, so Akebi-chan's Sailor Uniform, which is currently running as an anime TV series. I got the first volume and I really love the art style. Have a look at this. Hiro, the artist, he really knows how to draw and the covers look gorgeous as well. Is there anything under the covers? Yeah, there is. Always some really pretty artwork. I think she's underaged. That's not good. Okay, that's better. So, volume three. I thought Baiyi forgot uh, volume 6, but here it is. Look at those poses. It's just incredible. And you can tell that the artist Hiro wanted to become an animator. I don't know if he had formal training, but I know that his wish was to become an animator because he saw an anime TV series which had great animation, and that was Kamichu, a series which takes place like in Hiroshima prefecture. Hiro started to study anatomy, like uh, dessin, human drawings in university, and he got then into manga. You can really tell that he is not just a simple manga artist, but he is someone who has a really good grasp of human anatomy in general. This panel here reminds me just a tiny little bit of Yokohama Kaidashi Kiko. Like the clouds, the shadows, the light. Then I got volume two of Furoran.
Volume 10 of Soredemo Ayumu wa Yosetukuru. This is a small, very tiny, small illustration by Sakura Norioi from Boku no Kokoro no Yabai Yatsu. Then I got this horror manga. It's called Phobia and it's by Goto Yukiko. Now Goto Yukiko, this is a female artist which I discovered around 10 years ago with a manga called Ushiharu, which was like a kind of gag manga. She originally started with like gag manga, which have like a lot of sexuality. And now she's doing more like the serious stuff. And this one is a horror manga. It's not based on a story by her, but the drawings are by her, of course. I think it's an art style where you can tell that she still draws with a brush rather than like a pen, like a thick brush for the hair and for the outlines. So I'm looking forward for this one. And finally, Hare Hare Biori by Yoshi Yoshimura. I just came across this manga while browsing in the catalog of Honto. This looks quite pretty actually. It looks quite okay-ish. Yeah. Looks totally innocent to me. Like a slice of life, Ningen Dorama with a little bit of comedy. Now on to the art box. What do we have here? An illustration art book of Hiro, the artist behind Akebi-chan's sailor uniform. It's a smaller format for an art book, but it's rather thick and it contains apparently 200 illustrations. And there are some illustration from earlier works. His style was great even back then. Oh, this is from Super Cup, which was an anime last year. And again, some color illustration. I gotta say, this is a pretty good art book. It's only 1,500 yen. This is an excellent price for such a great art book. It's called Hiro Iras to Shu. The publisher is Shueisha.
this is a small, even smaller art book from an artist called Koto Tsumi. You can see the size, it's smaller. It's bigger than your usual manga, but it's smaller than a regular art book. I don't know this artist. I'm not even sure if she's actually Japanese. It might be that she is actually a foreigner, but like living in Japan. Like uh, an artist from Taiwan, maybe? So, wow. That's excellent. So it's very playful with the colors. It reminds me a little bit of like pop art. With like the, the contrast of the colors. It's like quite pop artish. Yeah, Andy Warhol says hi. Man, it looks great. It's quite thick, so it's not so easy to hold in the hands and to open it without damaging the obby. Very, very pop artish. Look at this. And then again, more pop art. Look at the shadow on her face. I love this. And again, this is quite realistic. It's just amazing. Different styles just like uh, the simple line art and then the use of color. It's just skillful as hell. There are only women, no men. But I'm not complaining, just saying. Wow, look at this again. It's like hyper-realistic. And then you get like more like traditional manga type style of illustrations and some really bizarre stuff. Okay, that's very 1980s. Yeah, definitely 1980s. She has Twitter and Instagram, of course, but is there any more information about her? No. Okay, the book came out last year in March. It's super thick, as you can tell, this one, if you compare it with this one. This is definitely worth your money. And this as well. These are like some of the better art books I have bought in the last years. Definitely. Yeah, that was it for today's unboxing video. I hope you liked it. What do you think of my general selection this time? I was really keen on getting the volumes of Akebi-chan no Seira Fuku, as you can tell, but I also wanted to have a little bit of variation, not only just rom-com and like slice of life stuff, but also like a horror manga this time. So let me know in the comments down below if there's any manga you would like to buy for yourself and see you next time. Goodbye.